Let's solve this second task. First of all, let's write the function. Let's keep all the variables float. Let's make it more simple. Let's just write this. Okay, now we have to provide default values for all these functions, uh, all these variables. So let's say we keep the height as three and the base as two. Let's give a prototype. Let's see the output. What? Oh, I've made a mistake. I forgot one thing. The default values can only be written in the prototype, not in the actual function definition. So, so this is a mistake. Let's correct it. Okay, there's a problem with this this site um, it's not letting me enter a value so you see instead of prompting me to enter the value of c in it has just assumed it as zero it has assumed the values of b and h as zero and passed those values so let's change the compiler I'm, I'm changing the this online compiler I'm going to another online compiler let's do that I'm just gonna copy the code and paste it there so this is another online compiler that I have searched. Let's paste the code here. By the way, you can find this online compiler at this link. I'll paste the link here. So if you wanna use it, you can go to this link, find this compiler. Okay, now let's see. So this was our code, let's run it. Let's say the base is 5 and the height is, let's say, 4. So the answer should be 10. Yeah, the, the answer is right. So for now, um, the values that I have sent, B and H, they are used and the default values are ignored. Now let's see if I don't pass H. Let's see if I just pass B. So what happens in that case? Which value will be used then, right? So let's run it again. Let's pass it the same values, 5, 
and and 4 and this time 4 should be ignored so answer should not be 10 yeah answer is not 10 answer, answers 7.5 so 5 multiplied by 3 15 and divided by 2 so that's 7.5 so you see they are ignored let's try it one more time let's don't let's not send it any value so so let's call it like this and then let's run it so now it should be 3 into 2 uh, 6 divided by uh, 2 is 3 okay I'm passing it the same values again and the answer is not 10 it's 3 so so you can properly see the working uh, now and understand it